Hi, welcome to this tutorial. We're on Arch Labs and we are looking at a screen having plank here on the sides, having the Areola Azura at the top. And these are my settings for you to see. The topic of the tutorial is actually to change your group. So when you boot, you have this choice uh, to test your RAM, to boot your your distro and this black image you can put also an image behind it and it's done quite easily without knowing anything about where Grub keeps all its stuff it's done easily with a program and the program that I'm going to look for is um, on my github you will find uh, github.com slash Eric Dubois Arch Labs we have this installation folder and it's in here I keep it around because it's quite interesting and we type in dot slash and then we install something we press tab and it's called group customizer so it's this little program that we install from the AUR I've just installed it so the only thing we can do now is go ahead and see what it does what it um, is written like so it's this little name, this is the name you actually should look with Yaourt, with Packer, with Packer. So this little program is going to take one of the three, whichever one is available, and it's going to start first with Packer. And then at the end, it's gonna check if it's installed. So this is the message we're getting. It's group customizer is already installed. So that's this line we're getting. Fine, okay, the program is present already. Of course, this is um, a standard menu, so it's not in here yet, so we should make it ourselves. It's not an OP menu generator that we have, so this is a standard one. Um, but there are other things. We programmed Control Alt A inside it, uh, which is the application finder. So, group, there it is. Escape, so that's the application finder from XFCE. But I rather go with Windows D, which is a D menu. And here as well, I can type the first letters group customizer and you'll have your choice with all the groups. So we need this one, group customizer. In my shortcuts as well, the Windows Shift D, which is a more uh, orange kind of look, but it gives us the same thing, group customizer. Okay, let's go. If you did not uh, change your settings in the auto start, you will not be able to log on here. So you have to do that first. So you have to be root to do this, of course. We're going to write to some, some quite the important files, some uh, root files, and we must have some clearance. It's up here that we have to change it. So this is the list, general settings, the fun start here. Custom resolution, I've set it to auto, but you can set, set it to anything you like. But auto is maybe best thing to do. I've got rid of auto now. Let's type it again, like so. And then have some fonts and colors you can change around. You don't have that much choice, but there is enough choice to have some coloring. So blue, transparent, light red, transparent. I advise you not to use the font. And then we have to get our wallpaper some kind of wallpaper and this one is from the uh, Google Plus and we have now a vision of what it would might look like it's not exactly like this but it has lines uh, behind it and as well etc but this is what it will look like more or less of so if, if you don't like the color it's now time to change it but that's it actually so change the colors uh, eventually transparent color or a real color behind it and red and don't touch the fonts take a picture it's this is one is a very large picture maybe interesting to see how large things can go without having any problems so properties image 3840 by 2060 and I have 1980 by 1020 I think or 1080 anyway you know the, the full HD size so even with these big amount of pixels this large image I have no problems booting that's good 
Fine, so you get yourself a nice wallpaper and then the coloring and all you have to do is save. And then when you reboot, you will see that the image will be applied and the logo is in here and the, the lines, horizontal, vertical, a box line goes around it and you'll have a particular personal kind of way to boot up your Arch Labs. Enjoy!